Dear friends, we make all our videos thanks to your views on YouTube. But recently, YouTube has been limiting our income a little. In order to continue shooting beautiful girls for you, we would like to ask you for a little financial help. All links in the description. Hello and welcome to another episode of SLS Drift Taxi. Today we are joined by the lovely and beautiful Julia. Hey there, Julia. Hi. So tell me, Julia, I'm looking at you and... Uh, you are in fantastic shape now, aren't you? What do you do for a living? I'm a fitness model. Fitness model. That was a while ago, though. Oh, stop, you look great, seriously. Can something be done with me? Of course. I'd really like to get rid of my belly. I like sleeping on my belly, but I can't. It's doable. What do I have to do? Quit drinking, for starters. Okay, then. It appears that exercise is not my thing. Why don't we talk about... So, what do you... What do you enjoy most in this life? How do you kick back and enjoy yourself? When I'm photographed. You enjoy being photographed? You got a lot of subs? 6,000? That's not a lot. Well, I'm not saying it is. I don't want a ton of subs. Then why do you love being photographed? I mean, you do have something to offer, don't you? Why not 250 million? I don't want to have to react to all of the comments and so on. Oh, so that's it. Yeah, that gets me too. I also get upset by hateful comments. Okay, racing, cars, your favorite car brand? I don't really care. What do you like in cars? I just enjoy driving. Behind the wheel? Obviously. Well, my apologies that I'm going to be driving you around today. Can you trust me? Sure. You gonna be nervous? No. I'll make you nervous. Okay. Okay, let's head out, and after that we'll have a chat. SLS Drift Taxi, and we're only getting started. At your service, me and my steed. Safety has to be safe. You being all independent. You know, sometimes I like when a woman is independent. Oh, I don't even let anyone carry my purse. Why so? Does it make you nervous? I was just married for 15 years. Nobody ever helped me out, so I'm just not used to that. Well, there you go. I've heard the planets are aligning today. Today? Yeah, and the people are going a bit crazy. I know I am. That's what matters. Bear in mind that nobody's coming to watch that parade. True. Parades without any spectators. That's for sure. How are you getting through it? The planetary alignment? No, the whole COVID thing. You know, it's not like I don't believe it's real, it's just... Has your life changed at all? Not in the slightest. I am a bit stressed in the evenings at times. Why is that? Well, if you want to chill with some friends, for example. A lot of mine have isolated themselves. Yeah, I know a few people who in the first few weeks didn't leave their homes at all, even to take out the trash. It's weird strolling around town on the weekends and barely seeing anybody. I mean, there were moments. I actually enjoyed it. There was more room to breathe. You know, I'm also not a big fan of crowds, but I do like observing people. I'm gonna close the windows so that... No problem. And now we send it. Oh, 
<laughs> you know what you're doing, right? Is it okay I said that? I have no other words for this. That's why I asked you. I'm gonna let some air in. How was that? I enjoyed it. Oh wow, your tone shifted just like that. Like just now you were so emotional. That's my thing, I guess. I'm quick to... So you switch on the fly. I don't stay mad for long. Sometimes I'm explosive. Did you just train or did you train other people? I do have a degree as a trainer, but I never worked as one. It's just too monotonous of a job for me. And if it had become a job, I would have quit altogether. I just really love to train. And the point was never to get into shape or anything like that. I just like the process of training. It might be a physical or hormonal thing. It just makes me feel good. Brings me joy. In my opinion, you'd make a great mentor. Everybody keeps telling me that. All right then. Should we give that another try? Something just isn't right in that spot. <laughs> what makes you say that? Or is it with me on board? I want to slide the entire way. You know, I've never been outside of Russia. Well, I've been to Germany as a kid, but that doesn't count. And I never got around to making a travel passport. Since I get too many offers, I thought, what if I agreed just out of selfishness? <laughs> that I'd prefer to avoid. That sort of thing is unacceptable for me. And then the moment I got my passport, which was like in January or February, this whole thing began. People kept saying it's because I decided to start traveling. Well, that explains it. Same thing here. Something went wrong? That's likely because I'm here. You smell that? Yeah. That's the smell of drifting. It's because while we were moving, we were leaving behind clouds. Is that normal? It's the best. <laughs> Mind the building? That's a store that we were approaching. You could have hit the camera guy. That's the store right there that we almost drove into. Has anyone ever lost control and... Of course, like literally a week ago. Yeah? Yeah, someone did crash their car into it. Wanna go again? Lack of experience? Yeah, sure. Gotcha. That's how it happens. Did we hit it? Yeah. Hit a cone. I wanted something to go wrong. <laughs> Otherwise it's boring. Just give me a minute, I have to pick that cone up. Better keep your cheeks from shaking on camera. You know, I actually feel more relaxed after we had a chat. I mean, before I was in a rush, stuff was happening. Yeah, you seemed a bit tense. Now you get why people drift? Sure. Now I get it. I just needed to feel it for myself. It just sort of gives you a... You release your emotions and uh, you're feeling better. That's it.
Thank you. Hope you enjoyed that. Very much so. Let's go have a chat on camera. Okay, guys, we've just been out for a few laps with Julia. Tell me how that felt. That was your first time and you weren't even behind the wheel. That was quite interesting and frightening at first. She was displaying other kinds of emotions in the car. It was pretty breathtaking. I wanted some more. But at some point I even felt relaxed. When we just got started and we were chatting, I was really tense. Because I was in a hurry to get here. Business as usual. <laughs> I think I was one and a half hours late, right? But now everything is right in the world. So you're keen to keep riding? Sure, you'll happily stop on by again. Yes, of course. You know what? I heard you with your first piece of advice. Less drinking. Yes. You should... I guess I should... I could have said I want to look just as good as you. What's your end goal? To want myself? <laughs> right. I've always said that you need to perfect yourself to the point where you look in the mirror and you want what you see. Something I've already achieved. You want that as well? Yes. <laughs> right, guys, so if you'd like to... And you should follow Julia. Here's her Instagram. Go ahead and subscribe. But don't go messaging her with all sorts of BS, okay? That's not a nice thing to do. Here's my Instagram, send whatever you want. I'm not gonna read it anyway. Here's the SLS Drift Taxi Instagram, where we'll happily listen to your advice on how we can get better. Give us a big thumbs up on this video, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss the next one. The more bells and likes we get, the more and more episodes we put out. You've been watching Drift Taxi, the lovely Julia, Eugene the driver. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you.